Namaste, my friends. Welcome to your breathwork experience to cultivate inner peace. Today, we're going to move the body, start with a simple yoga flow, and then perform our breathwork exercises, specifically Anilum Vilum, or alternate nostril breathing, that will help balance both sides of our body and our brain. From there, we will end in a peaceful meditation. All you'll need is a mat and a meditation pillow. And if you're ready, let's begin. So we're going to get started on the back of our mat in child's pose. So inhale, reach the arms up. Exhale, lower down, bringing your forehead onto the mat. Take this moment to connect to your breath. Noticing your current state of being. Let's set our intention for our practice today. That we may release heaviness, tension, stress, and welcome greater peace and harmony. Breathe in, breathe out. Now walk your hands over to the right side of your mat. Breathing into our side body here, nice and calmly. Breathe in, breathe out. Walk your hands back to center and let's take it to the other side. Walking your hands to the left side of your mat. Feeling that gentle stretch in the side body. Your intercostal muscles, the muscles in between your ribs. Direct the flow of breath to this area. Breathe in. Breathe out. Walk your hands back to center. Take a breath here. And then gently come into your all fours position. Knees grounded, palms are pressed against the mat. Go ahead and just tap your feet here, releasing any tension in the feet. Good. Come back to center. We're going to arch the back as you inhale, look up. Exhale, round the spine and come back into your child's pose. Inhale, arch the back, look up. Exhale, round the spine into child's pose. So moving with your breath here. Inhale, arch. Exhale, round into child's pose. A few more times like this. Inhale, arch the back. Exhale, round the spine. Warming up our spine here. Inhale, arch. Exhale, child's pose. Beautiful. Now come back into your all fours position. Tuck your back toes. Press the palms against the mat. We're going to lift our hips 
into our downward facing dog. Go ahead and extend the legs. If you feel tension in your hamstrings, it's all good. Go ahead and walk your downward facing dog by pressing one heel and then the next, bending one knee at a time. Just doing some gentle movement here, doing what feels good on the body. When you feel ready, go ahead and stay in stillness in your downward facing dog. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, come forward into plank position. Exhale, push the hips back into downward facing dog. Breathe in, roll into plank. Breathe out, push back into downward dog. So keep moving the body like a wave. Really feeling this fluid motion. Beautiful, a few more times like this. Inhale, plank. Exhale, push the hips back. Good, inhale, plank. Now hold your high plank. We're going to lower our chest down, tuck the elbows in into our chaturanga. Slide forward into your upward facing dog. Lift those thighs off the mat. Push back into your downward dog. Beautiful job. Breathe in. Breathe out. Go ahead and take about four steps to the front of your mat, standing in a hip width position, folding from the hips, having a slight bend in the knees. Go ahead and begin rocking side to side. Grab the opposite elbows. Continue to rock, allowing everything to feel super heavy here. Moving the neck, releasing any tension in the upper back. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Release the arms, let them dangle. Slowly roll up for four, three, Two, one, inhale, reach up. Exhale, palms together, bring your palms to your heart. Beautiful. Bringing your feet together now. Take a breath, feel the stability. Feel how strong your foundation is. Breathe in, reach up, breathe out, dive it down, forward fold. Folding from your hips here, you can always have that slight bend in the knees. It's all good. Inhale, halfway lengthen, slide those hands up your legs, lengthen the spine. Exhale, forward fold. Drop your left foot back now, left knee on the floor. You can tuck your back toes or keep them flat. We're coming into our low lunge. Reach up, arms up, inhale, hold it here. Feeling that nice release in the hips. Breathe in, 
Breathe out, place your hands on your right knee. We're going to just pump slightly forward. Good. So pump it forward and back, really stretching our hips here. Beautiful, and hold it. Breathe in, arms up. Breathe out, drop the hands back on the mat. And we're going to push the hips back into our half split. Working with the breath here. Inhale, come forward into low lunge. Exhale, push the hips back, half split. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, half split. Keep going for a few times where we hold in our half split. Really opening up the heart here. Good. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, push the hips back. And let's hold it here. Holding our half split posture, our Ardu Hanuman Asana. Folding from our hips once again, you want to make sure that your right hip is pulled slightly back and your left hip is pushed slightly forward. Good. And connect here to your breath. With every breath, see if you can go a little bit deeper. Breathe in. Breathe out. Come back into that low lunge. Tuck the back toes. Lift into high lunge. We're going to ground the left palm and reach the right palm up to the sky into your twisted high lunge. You want to look up here, really lengthen, make sure your shoulders are square. Breathe. Breathe in. Breathe out. Bring the right palm back to your mat. And step your right foot back into your downward facing dog. Beautiful job, guys. Let's flow it out. Inhale. Exhale. Let it go. Inhale, come forward into plank. Exhale, chaturanga, lower the chest down. Inhale, upward facing dog. Lift those thighs off the mat. Exhale, downward facing dog. Inhale. Exhale, bend the knees. Either hop or take two steps to the front of your mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, reach the arms up as you stand tall. Exhale, palms together, hands to heart. Breathe in. Breathe out. Connecting to that breath. Notice how your body is starting to warm up, building heat, releasing tension. Beautiful. Inhale, reach up. Exhale, dive it down, forward fold. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, step your right leg back, drop the back knee. And again, you can keep your toes tucked under for more support, or you can flatten the foot here. 
Inhale, reach the arms up into your low lunge and hold. Feeling that nice stretch in your psoas muscles, the main muscles of our hips. Breathe in, breathe out. Place your hands on top of your left knee. And we're just going to pump slightly forward with the hips. So coming back and forward. Loosening up here. And hold. Reach the arms up as you inhale. Exhale, drop the hands back to your mat. Push the hips back into your half split. Working with the breath here. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale. Half split. Inhale, low lunge, look up, open the heart. Exhale, hips back, half split. A few more times like this. Inhale, low lunge. Exhale, half split. Really creating a lot of space here in our hips. Beautiful, inhale, low lunge. Exhale, push the hips back and let's hold our half split posture. Again, pulling the left hip back, pushing the right hip slightly forward and folding from our hips, trying to get our chest as close to the knee as possible. Connect to your breath here. Breathe in. Breathe out. Beautiful. Come back in that low lunge. We're going to ground our right palm. Tuck your back toes and lift up into high lunge. Left hand comes up to the sky, looking up towards your left fingers, and hold this gentle, twisted high lunge. Really building that digestive fire, that heat in the body. Breathe in, breathe out. Bring your left hand back on the mat. Step your left foot back into your downward facing dog. Beautiful job. Inhale, exhale. Inhale, come forward into plank. Hold the breath, exhale, chaturanga. Inhale, upward facing dog. Exhale, push the hips back, downward facing dog. Breathe in, breathe out. Bend your knees, take two steps, or hop to the front of your mat. Inhale, halfway lengthen. Exhale, forward fold. Inhale, reach up as you stand tall. Exhale, palms together over to your heart. Beautiful. Take a moment to connect to your body here. Notice how everything is feeling. Mm. 
Inhale, reach up. Exhale, hands to heart. Now we're going to balance on our tippy toes here. And then slowly lower it down. You can always place your fingertips on the mat here, just giving your toes a nice stretch. Or if you want to take it further, you could come into our cosmic egg, hugging your knees together, bringing your chin down toward the chest, and hold. Breathe in, breathe out, drop the heels, and come into a seated position. Beautiful. Now placing your arms underneath your knees, grab your opposite elbows here. Place your chin toward your chest. We're going to pull slightly back. You should feel a nice stretch in your shoulder blades, in your neck. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Go ahead and release. Come back all the way down. Head down to your mat. Knees into your chest. Go ahead and rock side to side. Giving your lumbar spine a nice massage here. Extend the left leg, drop it to the floor, right knee into your chest. Slowly circle that right hip. Feel free to circle it into bigger circles or smaller circles. Just warming up this hip joint here. Switch directions. Breathing nice and calmly. Beautiful. Hug that right knee into your chest and cross it over your chest. Extending that right arm to your side and looking over your right shoulder. Coming into our spinal twist. Connect to your breath here. And if that right knee can't touch the floor, it's okay. Just make sure to do what's best for your body. Breathe in, breathe out, come back to center. Bring both knees into your chest and let's take it to the other side. So right leg extends, drops to the mat. We're going to circle our left hip here. Breathing calmly. If anything cracks, it's all good. This is normal. Switch to the opposite direction. Now hug that left knee into your chest. And bring it across your chest, extending your left arm, looking over your left shoulder, coming into our spinal twist on the other side. Breathe. 
With every breath, allow the tension to slowly subside. Breathe in, breathe out, come back to center, hug both knees now into your chest, extend the legs upward holding the back of your legs. And then widening your knees, grabbing the outside of your ankles or your feet into your happy baby. Trying to bring those knees as close to the floor as possible. Feel free to include some gentle movement if you'd like, just rocking side to side. Till you're ready to find stillness in this posture. Wherever you may notice tension, breathe deeper into those areas. and release, dropping the feet down to your mat. Coming into our final posture, bringing the soles of our feet together in Supta Baddha Konasana, reclined butterfly pose. Arms are by your sides with the palms facing open. Take a deep breath in and a slow breath out. Deep breath in, slow breath. And again, deep breath in, slow breath out. Bring the knees together, roll over to one side in your fetal position. And slowly come up into a seated position. Take your time here. Breathe in, reach the arms up. Breathe out, bring the palms together over to your heart. Take this moment to notice how open your body is. We are now ready for our breathwork meditation. So grab your meditation pillow and I'll meet you back here on the mat. So today we're going to perform three rounds of Analum Vilum or alternate nostril breathing. You're going to take your right hand, you're going to bend your index and middle fingers, you're going to bring your right hand over to your nostrils, you're going to bring the chin slightly down toward the chest, your elbow is tucked into the body, not out like this, you'll get too tired, 
So tuck in that elbow and your right thumb will be on your right nostril and your ring and pinky finger will be on the left. We will block the right nostril, exhale out of the left, inhale through the left, block the left, exhale out the right. Inhale through the right, block the right, exhale out the left. So just like that, we're breathing in both sides of our body and brain, welcoming greater inner peace and harmony. So if you're ready, come into a comfortable seated position with the spine straight. Let's begin. Placing your hands on your knees in a mudra, connecting thumb and index finger. Close your eyes. Breathe in. Breathe out. Drop the shoulders away from the ears. Relax the face muscles. Simply welcome the present moment. Observe how your body is feeling. Notice the mind. Maybe it's calm or a bit restless. It's all good. Breathe in, breathe out. Come back to the intention you had set for yourself in the beginning of our practice today. May we cultivate that sense of peace within Fully present, not reminiscing about the past or planning for the future. Breathe in, breathe out. Now let's begin the first round of Analum Vilu. Bring the chin slightly down toward the chest. Bring the right hand over to your nose, bending the two peace fingers. Thumb on right nostril, ring and pinky on left. Elbow tucked into the body. Lock your right nostril, exhale out of the left. Full breath in through the left. Block the left, exhale out the right. Breathe in through the right. Block the right. Exhale out the left. Breathe in through the left. Exhale out the right. Breathe in through the right. Exhale out the left. Breathe in through the left, feel your belly expanding, move the breath up to the ribs and chest, 
Exhale slowly out the right. Breathe in through the right. Out the left. In through the left. Block the left, out the right. Breathe in through the right. Hold the breath. Release the hand back on your knee. Exhale slowly out of both nostrils. Relax your breathing. Connect to the very subtle sensations in your body. Everything is slowing down. Let it happen with a relaxed attitude. Beautiful. And now for the second round. This time I want you to visualize with every breath in this pure white light coming into your body, filling every cell of your being with vitality, peace, and clarity. And with every breath out, visualize a gray smoke leaving your body, letting go of all the heaviness, fear, worry, stress. It's all leaving with a breath out. So bring the chin down toward the chest, right hand over to your nose, thumb on right nostril, ring and pinky on left. Block the right, exhale out the left. Full breath in through the left. Block the left. Exhale out the right. Breathe in through the right. Block the right. Exhale out the left. Breathe in through the left. Exhale out the right. So keep breathing like this. In through one nostril and out the other. Visualizing this white light while you slow down your breathing. Keeping it nice and controlled.
Good. Take a few more breaths like this. Opening up and letting go. Whenever you get to your right nostril, take a full breath in through your right nostril. Hold the breath, release the hand back on your knee, exhale out of both nostrils. Let go of any control of your breath. We have welcomed fresh oxygen. Feel this clarity in your mind. And a greater sense of relaxation in your body. Beautiful. And now for our third and final round. Right hand over to your nose, chin slightly down, thumb on right nostril, ring and pinky on left. Lock the right nostril, exhale out the left. Full breath in through the left, belly expands, move the breath up to the ribs and chest, block the left nostril, exhale out the right. Breathe in through the right, exhale out the left. Breathe in through the left. Exhale out the right. So keep breathing like this. In through one nostril, out the other. See if you can really slow down your breath here without feeling a lack of air. Connecting to the three parts of our breathing system. Directing the breath to the belly, moving it up to the chest. Slowly out from the chest, down to the belly. Feeling more grounded with every breath you take.
beautiful. Notice with every breath in how the breath comes, passes through the eyebrows, fills your entire being with vitality. And with every breath out, you let go and surrender. Take a few more breaths like this. Beautiful. Take your last full inhalation through your right nostril. Hold the breath. Release the hand back on your knee as you exhale slowly out of both nostrils. Relax your breathing. Let it happen naturally. Connecting to all the sensations you feel. Relaxing the face muscles. Include a mini smile. Dropping the shoulders away from the ears as the spine lengthens. Simply welcoming a greater stillness within. Take a moment to observe your body from the top of your head all the way down. Beautiful. Notice how your breath is much more calmer and softer. Maybe you don't even have to breathe much. It's all good. Connect deeper within.
beautiful. Wherever your awareness is, rest it on your heart. Feeling your heart beating. Reminding you of the source of infinite peace and love that is already within. mind may come up with thoughts rooted in fear, but know that this is not you. You are the source of pure consciousness, filled with eternal bliss. Connect to this sense within. Breathe in. Breathe out. Feel free to continue sitting in this peaceful presence or close the practice with me by gently moving the fingers. Rub the palms of your hands together generating positivity and place your hands over your heart. Breathe in. Breathe out. Know that all the love you seek is already within you. Breathe in, breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. Rub the palms of your hands together again. Bring the palms over your eyes, connecting to any colors you may see. Gently massage the face muscles, your temples, your jaw, your neck and shoulders. 
and the rest of your body with patience and kindness. When you're ready, bring the palms together in prayer in front of your heart. Bow down to your own heart, thanking yourself for doing something good for your well-being. May you be blessed with peace, love, and wisdom. Namaste. When you're ready, gently blink your eyes open. Thank you so much for joining me. If your foot got a bit numb, it's all good, as we welcome and transition back into this presence. Just shift your body here, placing the heels down on your mat, your bottom is close to your heels and begin to lay on your back. Arms are by your sides, palms facing open. Feel free to keep your awareness within. The energy is slowly moving down to your feet. Give it all space. And when you feel ready, you can begin to extend one leg at a time. Really taking your time here, don't rush. Feels okay, extend both legs out now into your Shavasana. Just allow yourself to bask in this peaceful presence for just a few more moments. When you feel ready, reach the arms up over your head. Roll over to one side as you bend the knees. Come back up to your seated position. You should feel your foot again. Thank you so much for joining me for this breathwork experience. I hope you take the sense of peace with you throughout your day. Much love. And I'll see you again next time.